Hello everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm doing it. First week of June reading start from the 1st through the 7th of June 2021. This reading is going to be for the sign of, I think it's going to be Libra. Yeah, this reading is going to be for the sign of Libra. So let's see how the first week is going to be for you guys for, um, start from the 1st through the 7th of uh, June 2021. I will add Oracle cards in this reading, but no charms will be added. So stay tuned. And now uh, while I shuffle the cards, let me remind you, it's a general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the messages which are resonating only the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. So let's dive into the read and let's find out how the first week going to be for Libras. Let's begin. Five of Swords, Ten of Swords, the Moon. Seems like you have walked away from something. It can be a situation, person, relationship. Um, you are not happy with it, but at the same time, I do see that you are uh, kind of, you know, trying to stay positive. Uh, you are trying to stay away from that one person relationship, but at the same time, deep down, you're still wishing and hoping for that one person, that one situation to work out well for you. Now, um, for some of you, you might have had addiction to this person. You might have had, uh, you know, a, a strong attachment with this person. But then at the same time, you feel like, you know, it's, it's not heading the right way forward. It does make you feel bad. It does make you feel um, toxic at times. And you really don't want to deal with that. So you chose to walk away, taking, you know, the courage to, to take that step forward. And... Um, have something better in your life with the with be the same person or somebody new so i feel like you know you are going to choose to walk away move away from a situation which was causing you a lot of stress anxiety in your life um deep down uh having said all that deep down you're still connected to the same person deep down you're still thinking about the same person deep down you still want this situation to work out so i feel like you know there is a lot of love that you have for a specific someone but at the same time, you want things to change, which are not, you know, happening right now. Um, for some of you, you, you might realize that you have to leave certain patterns in love life behind uh, just to get a better result this time around. Maybe that's going to be the case for some of you as well. But again, there is no doubt around a situation where you have strong feelings for a person. You really want things to work out with that one person. But somehow... For some of you, maybe it's your person's uh, situation where you are tired of dealing with them and you really want them to understand the worth of the connection before you could give into it again. So maybe you are waiting for that person to change or maybe it's high time that you change yourself with this person so you could get a different result this time around. Let's take more cards. Queen of Cups, there is a strong love in this connection. I feel like you know either one of you really want this connection to move forward but it's not moving forward. Now again, there has been a cycle that you might be experiencing in your love life with your specific someone that needs to change. How do we change a cycle? We have to break free from an old pattern to have a new pattern built. Now, it's very important. I feel like, you know, either one of you really want things to be stable, moving towards a better future together. But somehow one person is starting, you know, taking that decision. Uh, one person is not ready to give in. Um, the thing which is causing this person to take their time to decide about this connection is maybe the past addiction of you to them or them to you. There is a fear-based energy in this connection which is not letting you to have a better future together. There is like, you know, this thing, uh, you, you will, you will uh, rin the peace of this person or you, uh, you fear that your person is going to rin the peace for you in your life. Um, there is a fear that is basically causing this connection not to move forward in the right direction you do have a past with this person for sure so i feel like you know it's high time that you understand that if you want a better result this time around be that you are a libra or a cross watcher you have to deal with this connection separately differently this time around let's see what the oracle has to add to the lead let's find out <clears throat> give space let there be closeness between you but always give each other space love never claims it simply allows and gives now it's very important for you to have some space for yourself and give space to the person that you are dealing with i feel like you know that is a must in this connection because you need to heal the past 
or you need to heal from the past that you have had with the same person why because there is something from the past which is stopping this connection to move forward so something needs to be healed from the past before you could have a uh, next step in this connection with your specific someone somebody is like taking decision based on the fears from the past be that you or the person that you are dealing with so that needs to change um you deserve the best reach for the stars with your dreams and desires and don't compromise now i feel like you know either one of you really want things to move forward they want to get married to you they want to get committed to you it can be you also like you know who who desire this but it's not happening because somebody is um, not taking the decision that they believe they want to take they are making a decision based on their fears because of the past now the past could be of you two together or the past that they might have had in the uh, in their love life specifically as well so somebody really needs to break free from the past blocks don't let the past hold you back in this situation because it's not healthy like you know don't make any decision in your love life based on your past so just try to understand that let's see what else do we have it's time to take action for some of you it's very important for you to take action again how do you take action in this particular situation by healing yourself first by healing the connection if that's needed in the situation that you are dealing with uh, your specific someone um once the healing and uh, healing is done on your part on your person's part or if if you want you can heal the connection as well if you do that once it is done trust me your love life with your specific someone will move forward in the right direction um don't let your past hold you back so it's again it's very important for you not to let your past hold you back from this you know connection to take it forward to the next level you are very close to achieving your goal again if you want to achieve your goal you have to try things differently this time with your person otherwise you're not going to get the result that you want let's take one more card from this deck and we are done for this read libras somebody really needs to change the pattern here to get a different result or a different outcome in a relationship that you have with your specific someone let's take one last card healer of abundance never doubt that you can make a difference you definitely have all the power that you need right now in this situation whether you think it's your person's energy and they want to heal and they need to heal you can always still have the control over every situation that is happening in your life you have all the control that you need your creativity ability to uh, to be innovative make you destined to succeed it might be time to expand your career but don't forget to leave time for family this situation involves a person possibly you who's down to earth with a gift of design or decorating he or she is open minded and nurturing now if it's you you have to nurture yourself and the connection that you have with your specific someone if it's them maybe they need to heal themselves and the connection as well with you so yeah this pretty much it coming up for you for this uh week time if the reading resonated with you do like share and subscribe and if you're willing to get a personal lead you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye bye